Have the confidence and faith in yourself to know that if you're doing what you love and you really truly believe in it, that it's going to work. Yo, yo, dude, yo, Sender Nation. It's Tuesday. This December challenge, guys, has been freaking amazing. Thank you so much for being a part of it. Um, it's actually, it's ending soon. So at the end of this week, Brandon and I are going to San Andres, which is a little, it's like a beach island off the coast of Nicaragua. It's a Colombian island. Um, we went there last year. But I don't think we shot any videos there, though. So anyway, we're gonna be off the grid for a good five days. And I think that is exactly what we need just because of all the, just work and stuff that's that's we've been doing every single day up until this point. So it's gonna be good to go there. And not only do we get to go there and chill for a couple of days, but we're gonna shoot an awesome video for you guys. So stay tuned for that. Regular water, regular. Uh, hope Brandon's ready for me because I have a lot of energy. Energy. Fresh. Yeah. You like that? You like to eat fresh, do you? We're gonna get a bunch of stuff. We have so much stuff going on um, on the back end of Zen Dude Fitness. We're, we're right now creating, um, we're bundling our packages together. Basically, we're doing a bunch of stuff to our website to make it easier for people to purchase jump ropes and our courses and get discounts on bundles of them. It just, it, it involves a lot of work on the back end. Obviously I'm coding the whole thing because uh, I'm a pretty smart computer programmer. I've never written a line of code in my life. Dude, no, uh, dude, no, uh. What's that, batch? Do you drink enough water? Seriously, like, the reason that I keep yelling fruit water and regular water and athletic greens juice water is because you guys need to drink water. Okay, your body must be hydrated in order for it to function optimally. <laughs> Brandon's in his room doing a voiceover right now. I want fruit water? Fruit water? Fruit water? Fruit water. Get out of here. Oh, oh, oh. I think those limes are old. Uh, oh, it's funny, fruit water. Yeah, it's really funny. <laughs> Today, we have to record a podcast because we've been slacking on that Zendit Fitness. So be sure to check out the Zendit Fitness podcast. It's It comes in our Tuesday tip email. Um, I'll also link it up for you in the description. I cannot have a complete day unless I dance. I don't dance every day, but I try. Hey, shut up. Shut up. We were checking into our Google Analytics and we wanted to make full length workouts because some people were asking for them. Um, but our YouTube data tells us actually, y'all ain't watching them. Pe ain't watching no people videos. don't want to watch full length workouts. You know, it's an experiment. We uh, we obviously are gonna continue to, make, continue to make workouts, but they're probably gonna be like 10 minute workouts. So we're probably gonna do the first two circuits with you guys and coach you and then you'll do the ones right after that. Again, I apologize to those people who wanted the full length workouts, but guys, it seems that a majority of our community is asking us for 10 minute workouts. Data don't lie, folks. I've had regular water, then I had fruit water. Now I'm having athletic greens water. Athletic greens water. Uh, <laughs> green juice, bro. What time is it? It's mother Jones time. What does that mean? It means it's time to go eat. Oh, Jones time. Yeah. Hello there, it's Jones time. Hello. Hello, hi there. That's a lot of chicken. A lot of chicken. A lot of chicken you got there, Brandon. Okay, I'm just gonna tell you right now, we decided to do it. We're getting a drone. We're going right now 
to get a drone to take to San Andres. Here's the deal. The drone that we wanted to buy is like twice as expensive as it is in the US. So we're gonna wait and we're just gonna get a new GoPro to film some stuff in San Andres. Still gonna be an epic video, but just wait till we get the drone. Wait, just wait. On it. Didn't get the drone, disappointed, but it makes me even more motivated to make an epic video without the drone and just get other parts of my editing, Brendan and I's editing better, so that when we have the drone, we can be even better, if that makes sense, rather than get the drone prematurely and not really know how to use those kinds of shots in our videos. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, that's whatever. Secondly, I'm, I wanted to talk about something really quick because I am going to get dinner and eat at the same place that you guys have seen. It's Botanica. I go there because they have this salad that has a ton of protein and it's super healthy with a ton of greens. There's like apples, lentils, uh, spinach, spring mix, all kinds of good stuff. Cheese, uh, like Parmesan cheese and then big blocks of chicken. Really good seasoned chicken too. Um, so I always go there because it's an easy place for me to get my greens and hit my macros. I think it's important to note that like some days are just not fun days. Like when I see people vlogging on YouTube, it's typically a lot of like, it's not always that they're doing something awesome, but it's like, that's what, you know, if they're a pretty famous YouTuber, they're typically at the point where they have enough money to just go and do awesome things and they get paid through their ad revenue. Um, or they have another business that they started a long time ago. And that's really the point that Brandon and I want to be at. Right now, we are in a great place. We've grown our business from zero dollars to over a six-figure business in a year, so that's awesome. Um, however, at the same time, like, we're not gonna be vlogging us like jumping off cliffs every day. This past year was the best year of my entire life and has taught me so many things. But I say that because it's important to note, like we weren't just goofing off. I have, I have, ne oh my God, I have never, ever, ever, ever worked this hard in my life. Like even though last year was the best year and even though, yes, I do wake up every day, like I'll, I'll just be straight with you. I wake up every day and I, do, I am like, Fuck yeah, like even when things stress me out, I'm like, well, listen, man, you could be like at your old job or whatever. So I am extremely grateful and extremely happy for this opportunity. Having said that, um, it's not all like we're just laughing and like going on trips and traveling and we're not there yet in terms of our business. Like we still have a long ways to go and that I think is a great metaphor for you guys who might be trying to get fit and they're like, oh, you know, nothing's happening. I've been working out. I've been being consistent. What's going on? The answer is continue to be consistent. For every day that you see on our vlog that's like super fun and crazy, there are five other days where, like this, where literally we're working from the moment we wake up till the moment that we go to sleep. And we're just showing you guys everything in between. So same with fitness. Not every day is gonna be amazing and you're gonna feel this like, you're gonna have this awesome workout and you're gonna feel awesome afterwards and everyone's gonna come up to you and be like, oh my God, you look so good. What do you do for like, where do you go to the gym? No, you're gonna have a lot of really mundane days where you just have to be consistent and you wanna go to the internet and find out like, well, what's the newest food or what's the newest? No, just hit your macros and be consistent and work out every day and do that until you freaking have your body. Like until you have the body that you want. Don't give up until that point. Don't put a timeline on it. So what I'm trying to say is guys, sometimes in this vlog right now, you're not gonna see all this craziness and that's just part of the process. That's part of building a business. Like, you know, Brandon and I live amazing lives full of adventure. We have a lot of fun and we love doing it. We love making these videos, but right, like we work all the time. Like there is no Saturday and Sunday for anyone, let alone, like if you start your own business, 
there is no Saturday and Sunday, just like for us. Like we wake up and we do the same thing every day. There's no breaks. So guys, in saying all this, do the work that's required in the trenches, put the work in so that, and enjoy it. A lot of people just put the work in and then you know delay their happiness to a later point in time. What I'm saying is do the work, enjoy the work, love the entire process, have fun with the entire process, and just believe in yourself. And know, like, because know that in the future it's going to work out. Have the confidence and faith in yourself to know that if you're doing what you love and you really truly believe in it, that it's going to work. I think what it ultimately uh, come down to is that it's like God and transformers and then people. And I'm like, I was like a transformer and then I moved up to God and now I'm like, I don't even know what they're calling it because like it's too advanced. Yeah. I thought it was a Zen God. Nah, it's a do God. It's a do God. It's a do God. Yeah, it's a do God. Damn.